people will come, Ray. Dear Diary, Grandfather's as creaky as his front porch, loads his shotgun beneath the awning, spittoon restless for rain, carpenter's chair against the whistling air, rocking back and forth, rocking, snapshot picture worth it, just like the movies. He said that he loved baseball, and James Earl Jones said he's got God talking inside of his thoughts as he's rounding those bases on his way back home. If you build it, they will listens to what the Lord say. I've been getting pretty worn building for nearly a decade. In a perfect world, we shouldn't have been allowed to lose sight of what it means to love holy. I got a Polaroid hanging on my wall that a friend took of me and my angel. I remember the day like it's something I can touch, but it's stuck in the square between the borders of the film, and I can run my fingers over our faces, but I can't get back to the places we were. You got a pain deep in your bones, son. It compels you forward like you're tied to a slave master's cruel hand, and it's the same pain that drives that person on the stone. So you've grown to love the man. You keep pouring yourself out again and again into legible lines for a crooked man. It's painful, but it's familiar. It's a habit for its comfort, and I don't know what I'd do without Early morning, when you thought we sleep in our home, I drift back into the memories that I claimed as my own and wonder if tonight will be a night that I hang on my wall like I did before we stopped taking photos out of the habit of being comfortable with not trying at all. In a perfect world, we'll have albums labeled Seasons with chapter headings and we'll staple them to the cork board that hangs at the foot of the bed. There's longevity in a memory spilt out in pen picture is worth a thousand words. I've written down every one of them. I work hard, scarred, toil through the soil for the youth I see in my friends. But these journals are moments in time, snapshots of our lives in a retrospect. Age is an overexposed photo that the memories can't mend. I know my sweet seductress, and her name is Depression. I wrote best beneath that demon's destructive oppression. Those polar she drove the ink into the canvas like a slave beneath his master's cruel hand. I hated that whip, but always wondered what I'd do without it. So I grew to love the man. I went for change. I begged for movement. And the good Lord, he answered my prayers. But you don't know how to breathe easily. I call your comforts. Even if your habits left you gasping for air. Dear time, grandfather's as creaky as his front Sent like oil in the gun barrel, dip can kicked over the railing, sandpaper hands stuck behind thumbtacks on my wall. I got an ache in my chest for every season I miss, and it gets worse when the snow starts to fall. There are butterflies alive in that couple's eyes, a few years since forgotten by all, and sometimes if the phone starts to ring, I can still hear their wings when you call. But I begged for movement and got what I asked for. I can picture the answer like it came yesterday. And in the land of the gods, I think that things are timeless. But we are still prone to decay. You know, I still lift up hope of certain smiles and those photos from us when I pray. Time is a cruel lover. She breaks her house apart in its bones. You know, comfort is no good reason for standing still. And idle hands build nothing that you can call your own.